the trajectory of uh, at least the, the one that OpenAI have proposed is that the generative AI, you know, it has a, a kind of a trajectory going to AGI, right? I don't think they're going to get there that way. Uh, I don't, OpenAI is not going to take us to AGI is my prediction. I'll take that stand today. Uh, one of the one of the reasons for that is because they're they're torn between commercializing what they're doing and actually taking a step back and looking at what's not working. I'm much more interested in the work of people like uh, Subaru and his LLM modulo work, or Jan LeCun and the work he's doing, where he's basically said, "I'm done with LLMs." This is the guy who was given a Turing Award for helping to build these things. He's he's done with them. He he's on to new things. He he's trying to build world models. Now he's not. He's exaggerating a little bit. He still wants to use that technology eventually, but he's realized there's some inherent limitations in language-based models when you compare with how humans learn and adapt to their environment, much of which happens before humans can even speak and even and communicate with language. So putting our trust in these companies to take us to this so-called AGI is like really, really perilous, and, and, and I don't think it's going to work.